Conveyor system of haulage. Conveyor system of haulage are of two types. Belt conveyor. Chain conveyor. The belt conveyor is basically an endless belt in a straight line, stretched between two drums, one driving the system, and other acting as a return drum. In coal mines, and other mines of stratified deposits, where the underground mineral, if won by long wall method, the transport media, which often consists of conveyor. The belt, is an endless thick flat strip of woven cotton, rayon, or nylon fabric laid up in piles, or layers, and their surfaces and sides covered with rubber, plastic or PVC the belt having nylon fabric, are strong, as nylon offers very high resistance, to longitudinal tearing, and damage due to edge turn up. Nylon also improves the resistance, to impact damage, and the belts are more flexible, light in weight, have better fastener holding properties, and are also designed for use on deep troughing idlers. Such belts, are however costlier, than the cotton fabric belts. Cotton carcass, is more susceptible to moisture, and it rots on account of fungus formation, in the presence of moisture. Belt covered by a layer PVC instead of rubber, are fireproof, and only such PVC coated belts have to be used, in underground coal mines in accordance, with the directions of the DGMS. The PVC belt, is resistant, to grease and oil. One disadvantage of PVC coating, is that, it has a low coefficient of friction, rendering the belt unsuitable for steep gradients. Normally a belt conveyor, with rubber coating, is capable of working, on a limiting gradient of 1 in 5, without any braking arrangement with thrust or brake, the limiting gradient is 1 in 3. The maximum angle of inclination, for conveying coal on plied PVC belting is 16 degrees. The belt conveyor works on the straight roadways, which may be level, inclined, or partly level, and partly inclined in patches. The conveyor must be erected, in correct alignment. The belt speed varies from, 45 meter per minute to 60 meter per minute, is generally preferred. The belt end, are joined by hinged plate joints, or wire hook joints, the latter being popular on account of their strength and are made more quickly, than the hinged plate type. The belt ends, can also be vulcanized, but vulcanization requires special electrically heated press, and it also calls, for special technique. PVC covered belts, are joined by metal fasteners. Belt widths vary from, 0.60 meter for face conveyors to 1 meter for trunk conveyors in underground tall mines, but surface installations, may have belts as wide as, 1.2 meter or even more as at Nevely Lights mines. The maximum size is 1.5 meter. The carrying capacities of the belts are as follows, for a trough belt, with a speed of 30 meter per minute, with uniform feet of coal. If the belt speed is 60 meter per minute, the capacity is obviously double. The capacity can thus be calculated. If the feed, is not uniform, as very often happens, the capacity will usually, 30 to 60 percent of the calculated value. Compared to a trough belt, a flat belt has nearly 50 percent carrying capacity. The maximum lump size carried by a belt conveyor, is limited, to about half the belt width but large sizes like, this cause spilling of the material. The carrying capacity of trough the belt conveyor, is given by T equals ABV. Where, T equals the carrying capacity. In tons per seconds A equals the average cross-sectional, R of material. In meter square B equals the bulk density. Tone slash meter cube. This relates to density of broken material including sur spaces. V equals speed of conveyor belt, in meter per second. For a belt of width, W the value of the area varies approximately between W square upon 10 and W square upon 12. Depending on the nature of the material. The belts manufactured in this country, are from 3 ply construction, to 8 ply construction, 
but PVC belts, are available only of 3 and 4 ply construction. Thanks for watching. Like, comments, share and subscribe the channel for more upcoming mining related videos. If you have any mining related questions, ask in the bellow comments section.